Hey guys, welcome back to my kitchen. Let's stuff some more Licky Mats this week. So this week I am using the Licky Mat Slow Mo as well as the Licky Mat Soother. I have this in the original still as well as in the tough, but for today I'm using the original one. And I am going to start by using some baby food. This is turkey and turkey broth. Super yummy, right? Mmm, so glad I don't have to eat baby food. And I'm going to start by just gently smearing a little bit of that onto the mat. Whoop. Remember, make a mess, guys. You're not doing it right unless you're making a mess. I'll smear a little bit over on this one, too. So we're eating turkey this week, I guess. Spreading it out. Now, this isn't really so important. Uh, you still want it to be quality. You still want it to be something good and healthy you're eat, feeding your dog. Um, but this is just going to act as our sticking agent. What gets um, all of the goodies to actually stick to the licky mats. I'm then going to take some of CJ's kibble. I'm going to spread that out all over. And then I'm going to show you these guys uh, because we're using them. CJ seems to be loving them. But when you are starting any vitamin or supplement regimen with your dog, please check with your vet first to make sure that these are okay for them. So the first one I'm going to show you is, um, they're both by Zesty Paws. This is the Mobility Bites. It's for hip and joint. For CJ, he can have up to three a day of these. Um, we give him just one right now um, as he's getting used to him. I will be honest, he doesn't really love these. He could take them or leave them, um, but I'm still gonna put them on there because he does eat them when they're frozen. When they're fresh out of the lid, uh, he's like, mm, no thanks. But frozen, he loves them. Now the next one is a little bit different and a little bit weird, but some of you guys have um, expressed to me some issues with your dog eating poop. This one is the Zesty Paws Chew No Poo Bites. <laughs> um, say that 10 times fast. But it is also for gut health. So we've been giving it to CJ and you know, I think it's been going well. This one, he will re eat right out of the lid. He's outside right now or else he'd be begging for one of these. Um, again, he can have up to three of these a day. I give him one or two. They have a good um, like mint scent to them. So they could possibly help with breath, but I'm not saying that that's what's gonna happen. Um, CJ does tend to eat his poop every once in a while. So like if he gets something really, really good that he doesn't normally get, I like to joke around and say that he's going back for seconds. <laughs> um, I know it's kind of gross, but that's, you gotta make light of it. Um, but I have found that since giving him these, he is no longer going back for seconds. So these are two products that I am currently using and loving with CJ. But again, please, before you rush out and buy these, check with your vet. Make sure that this is good for your dog uh, because what's good for CJ may not be good for your dog. I am now going to pop these two in the freezer. I'm going to let CJ back in and then in a couple hours, he'll get to enjoy these. All right, guys, I'll see you next time. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. And as always, don't forget to tell your dog I said hi.